Right, so what I'll do first of all, we'll launch and then we'll just do an orbit around the airfield to get ourselves tidy, then we'll head across, call out to Mandrel. But we're actually going to launch and then we can RV with them down at Dunn's Nest. I hazard a guess they'll be a bit behind us, they've got further to fly. Roger. Rolling. Stand bit rolling now. Okay. Blue one rolling. Blue rolling. Blue lead airborne, gear up. Three rolling. Yeah, but this is past that. Good. Last end Go ahead, rolling. top that. Can't be reached. Let's move from here, whisper check. Thank you, Top Hat. Again, bit with your five by five. Three, two, five by five as well. Thank you, Top Hat. Just clicking left hand all the jets around the airfield. Top Hat. Blue one out, whisper check, please. Blue two out, Mark. Bowler coming in, Top Hat. Can you read me? Watch that, Bowler. Five by five. We know when you're airborne, it's a good reach. Now set 2300 RPM, 36 pounds into the Mercury. Low, low. Okay, I've got turret, turrets, I've got gunners engaging at will. Very nice. But yeah, we'll close up the uh, shit again. On the way for us to close up, please. Do not want to spread out. Yeah. Alright, I'm going to speed up on this hole. Do you want to throttle back to uh, 13 inches of mercury just to give you guys a chance to catch up? Throttle back to the mercury. Red section, me okay? I'll put yeah, my deep ground. I'll take it along the top. Nothing closest to you, the rest will be out here. Okay. Do I come back slower? So I'm, I'm, I'm merging with you now, but I'm... Uh, yeah. So am I. One person. Alright, 25 inches of mercury now. Although this is top hat. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm just, just trying to approach you at the moment. Solid. I'll stay here in this position, uh, which is, yeah, he's Confirm bowl, oh. bowlers are airborne. Up oh, my speed, my uh, 36 inch to Mercury now. 2300 RPM, 36 inch to Mercury. Speed to start the pickup. Five hundred feet, leveling out. Back to five fifty, but reduced. As I said, as we cross the channel, you'll pick up Woomera on heading up uh, one zero nine. You'll see the uh, town of Wilmora and you'll know it is because there'll be a large church. Look for the, as we see it, the left of the uh, town as we're approaching it, but it's to the north of the, uh, the village. We will then need to come south of it as if we're going to head towards Beloit, just so that we can approach the town from the south along the railway track. Okay? As we go down south, we'll then come up to about 500 feet plus, or about 1,000 feet rather, so we can get the bombs to arm as they drop, otherwise if they're too low, they won't arm before they hit the ground. At that point, once you believe the bomb, it's egress. 310, make pull in at best speed. 
Although before I had the head of the Dunn's Nest and the left hand order, the intention being that as we exit the Dunn's Nest, we should be adding a 109. We seem to be joined, joining red flight, kind of. Oh, well, maybe in time. Commander Gambit, we're about one minute out from the Dunn's Nest, we'll start the left hand order awaiting I you. See. I see, I see them all by 10 o'clock now, I'm just under the cloud. That's them, isn't it? That's it. Smart draw, Gambit, happy to draw. Copy that. Suggest you do one or two of it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We will egress from Dunstanis on, I think, at 109 degrees. Well, this mandrel ahead of us, just to the left as well. Got him. I think if we do one orbit, we should pretty well be, they'll be about a minute or two in front of us, we'll tuck up behind them. Sounds good to me. Mandrel camp, it happens you will do one orbit and then tuck in behind you. Okay. Alright. Someone's very tight behind me, so just get ready for this orbit, Ken. I want to muck it up now. Mandrel. Yeah, but this is top hat. Uh, what is your RV altitude, Dungeon S? Uh, at present, we're 2,000 feet. We're going to start a climb out over the channel. Roger that. Okay. New flight turning. Scan bits at 100 feet. Stranger, can you tell me okay. I've finished the back page at the time? So I'd like to go on the next one. Scan, we have some of these. Check your engine settings. Thank you, man. Double check. That'll just be someone on my camera. Yeah, should be an auto rich. Not full rich, auto rich. Top hat, this is Bowler. We're going to be uh, orbiting over Dungeness at about 1,000 feet. We had a mechanical issue with one of our pilots. He'll be right back. All right, Bowler, I'm coming up to one of our. My range of that distance, so probably pretty high. Uh, I now have um, Southeast Calais, so they're definitely headed on the same path. We're just crossing the same path. Hey, Sergeant Hunter. TP, as our uh, low level bombing specialist, what's the best timing for dropping bombs? Uh, as well, it disappears under the nose, or? Basically, yeah, yeah. if you're going in there, you just get the nose down and basically point the nose at the target you're going for. So you start at a thousand feet, and the target you want to see, just get the nose down, head towards it, release the bomb at the same time. Lovely. We can't skip bomb for yourself, we're not on the sea, but um, we can certainly drop them in. But don't drop them too late, otherwise they won't harm before they hit. Roger. Okay, blue flight is slowly, and now speaking of which, are we all still together, Blue Flight? Looks like it. About 50 yards behind. Start to make out the port of Boulogne at about uh, 1 o'clock. As we get closer, you'll see Wimmer Road, you'll see the church. I'll then start to head down towards Boulogne, cross the coast, pull up, up the coast, south to north, and then you'll, as you've seen on those pictures you had before, before the church is uh, where the engine sheds are. Stay tuned. Right, the village is on my 12 now. I'm going to come and veer to the right towards Boulogne. Okay? Mm -hmm. We veer towards Boulogne, but, but don't go in the harbour, you get shot at anyway. But veer towards Boulogne, and that way you'll be in the right position to fly up the coast to the village, now, which is now at about 11 o'clock. We see at 10 to 11 o'clock. So you know, we're heading for a position just north of Boulogne Harbour on the coast. What we'll do then, we'll club up and then have a look further up the coast for Wimmer Road. You'll see the church, drop all bombs before the church. Once you've passed over the church, it's too late. Do you have visual on the church now? you see it? Roger, visual on 10 o'clock. Right, so we're going a little bit further to the right now. 
if you've got the church beneath you, pick you've gone too far. It's all before the church, and it's on the far side of the village as we see it, where the railway line is. Okay? Roger. Pulling up. Committing attack. Okay, gentlemen. Right. Now, pick up the railway line. There's the railway line beneath us. You see the shed to the back of the right hand side? That's the target. Roger. Okay, going to the sheds. Both of the coaching plant. Blue flight, they're ready to drop. Right. Increase, head down, egress. Can you drop these off? On the way. 310, yeah. On the way. Egress, 310, 310, egress. Good, 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 Red section number. Which bit to turn in then? Yeah, uh, I've got the T on my low, yeah. low 3 o'clock now. Okay, blue 4 turning in. Blue red 4 turning in to land. Red 2 turning in to land. It's going to be a very short landing. You're in a Harrier? <laughs> yeah, basically. You have to be a. Basically, you have to be a Harrier to land at first. I'm going to choice of picking them. Suppress the picture update. Sorry, not them. First then. Andrew, this is Top Hat. Picture is starting to clear. Sure, I have congregations at an unknown altitude uh, over Calais at the moment. They might be uh, reforming the RTP. Okay, thank you, Top Hat. We're going to have a quick. Blue Pew is only off my own. Blue four downwind. 
Red for Bagdad, clearing out. Just going to wait for the last two of red section to head in to try. And will be advised contacts are being wet just north of Calais. Heading for you would be approximately 075. Red 2 is down. How many more to go? Still got two of uh, red section in the air and uh, I think two of blue in the air. Yeah, they lose four crosswind.